G'day everyone, it's Paul here from Creative Property at Walls End. Uh, tonight we're going to show you through 22 Hill Street. Um, this property has been in high demand and we just wanted to show as many of you all of the um, wonderful features that it offers. Uh, we're in the, just currently out the front in the drive and the reason being, obviously it's, it's been renewed. Um, this is a new driveway laid by the owners as well as the, the front fence which you can see on the images online but out the front you can see all of the solar um, that comes with the home and by all accounts and we've got documentation to back this up the owners get a credit on a quarterly basis um, for their power so they have got a lot of features that um, choose up juice like we all do these days um, in the modern modern world that we live in um, the likes of ducted air conditioning and they've actually got a aqua gymnasium out the back as well so you can only imagine to run that it costs a little bit of power um, but yeah they still get a credit on a quarterly basis which is, is really something and yeah once again while we're out the front here I'll just point out that there is a bus stop on this street um, in actual fact the bus went past a few moments ago um, which is another big selling point but we're not far from the main hub in Walls End which is just down Nelson Street, which is just to my right, uh, your left. So, um, yeah, can't wait to show you around tonight. Sing out and put your hand up if you have any questions. Um, no doubt we'll do our best to answer them. Um, out the front, you can see the, the lawn. It's quite level. Um, just pan around there and show you. That's the only lawn, so to speak, to maintain. Out the back is all very little. Uh, mate, in the, by the way of maintenance, it's uh, artificial turf out the back, which will be music to many people's ears. So that just goes hand in hand with having the um, swim spa out, out there as well, which is quite large. Um, down this side, you've just got pedestrian access down inside the garage and a water tank um, for your grey water. It's quite a unique entry um, for you, out, outdoors that is. It's, um, it's a big undercover space, perfect to greet the guests. And there's quite a large opening at the front. The, the front door is the biggest I think I've ever seen. It's 1,200 or maybe a bit more. It's like a, a whole wall opens up when you open it. And when we come, come through here, you'll see the kitchen behind me. Um, there's a perfect little corner to take your shoes off. If you've got little ones or even for the, the big kids, it's handy to sit down and Tuck them away for storage. We've got no pad on the side there. Nice big window that's north facing that one, covered by the shutters. And that's another deluxe feature of the home. It's got shutters right throughout, um, all in your classic white. I've just fired up this um, natural gas log fireplace. It was pretty easy, just the click of a button. I'm going to have to turn it off in a moment because it's really pumping it out. I set it to 21 degrees, but um, as you can see, that works extremely well and that's on um, underneath the stack of stone pattern that we've put in here which is a lovely feature all goes hand in hand with the renovation um, we've got LED down lighting throughout which is beautiful and then we've got the soft touch light switches which are high quality these are the little features that are extras right throughout the home. That one's got the, the dimmer switch. We had beautiful sunlight coming in through here this afternoon with that uh, front window and, and front door open. We've got a lovely floating floor. You can see the colour. It's very popular, that modern, hazy, grey timber floor. And what a beautiful kitchen. It really is. It's a pleasure to walk through and show this place. It's got not only waterfall ends on the island, it's even got it on the, um, the kitchen galley kitchen bench tops on this side as well. Here we have up above covered storage overhead. We've got one double power point. We've got three in the tower that disappears into the island, which is a great idea. And let's pop that down for a moment. These are the cutlery drawers, all soft clothes, fantastic storage. Even these cupboards have got drawers, so even though they're your conventional cupboard doors, it's so simple to, um, to find what you have 
even though they're nice and deep. These are rated to, I think, 35 or 45 kilo. Get plenty of plates and, yeah, utilise that as a pantry. And Siemens dishwasher, only the best. Black glass Siemens cooktop, once again, highest quality. We've got a dual oven system on the wall. And that's all Siemens. Very, uh, very smart. Bright blue splashback appliance cupboard. I'll pop away the toaster and kettle there in the corner if you, if you so desire. And once again, includes the nice big fridge space with some overhead storage. So, yeah, great idea. They've really um, brought it into the 21st century, this, this older dwelling, and yeah, it's a masterpiece now. You've got ducted air conditioning throughout, reverse cycle. If gas is not your thing, you can um, touch the other button and uh, switch that on, day or night. On this side of the kitchen, you might have seen there is breakfast bar, room for four stools, quite comfortably. Tuck your kids up there every morning, get their cereal going, get their, their day started. And one of the um, secondary bedrooms just to my left here, which, which has a piece of um, natural timber in the helmet up, up the top, which uh, we'll show you as well. Some nice downlighting in those those cornices. Very smart. Obviously ducted throughout, ducted air in here as well. We've got a massive wardrobe built in. Goes the full length of the room, which is approximately 3.6 metres, maybe a touch over. Good colour palette, nice and fresh. So you've got these little hints of natural products right throughout, which is a really clever way of integrating throughout the property. You'll, you'll see it in the, the ensuite bathroom, which has been renewed as well. On this wall, it's just feature oak. Absolutely perfect for this sort of high thoroughfare space. As we walk through, we'll see the next bedroom. Beautiful room in itself. Once again, we've got shutters. Nice window coverings, they're timeless. A bit of overhead storage above the window. It's quite cleverly thought out. Great light fittings, built in row, and your continuous floating timber floor system throughout the property, which makes it easier to look after, in my opinion. As we go down the hall, you'll notice that the high ceilings carry through, so you've got nine footers right through. Control panel up nice and high, so the little ones can't play with the, the buttons, change the zones on you, day and night. This is, um, yeah, obviously reverse cycle, which is really, really handy. We've got the original master bathroom, which would have been um, absolutely glamorous in its day and it's still in very good condition. It has a, um, a two-person spa built in and a nice big shower um, with a shelf that goes all the way around. Pretty helpful. Good for all ages. Nice big step up into the bath too. Black and white, it's quite classic. Never dates. This is um, your linen press in the hallway here. Little touches, a nice niche in the, um, the hallway there. I'm sure people can find knickknacks to put in there. Before we go out the back, which is where we're looking at the moment, I'll show you the master. Nice big window in this room, plenty of natural light in here. Obviously we're here in the, in the evening, but um, yeah, this is a walkthrough wardrobe. So both sides come in and out. Got room for bed size. Really well fitted out. And ensuite bathroom, superior size. Um, just a little step down in, into the bathroom. Once again, beautiful natural products. And a huge double size shower. 
um, integrated toilet, wall system built in, huge strip drains as you can see, so no issues with any, any water splashing out there, it's like a big wet room. Nice size vanity, heaps of storage. Four big drawers. I'll do the show you those. Just how big they are. Can't have too much of that. And beautiful basin. Very, very stylish. Custom light fitting. Throws off plenty of light. Beautiful big mirror, which is backlit. Another terrific feature. Let's see if I can show you that one. I don't know if you can see that in that video, but yeah, no shortage of lighting and shadows to the custom size in here as well. Oh, I'm just about tucked out with all those features and we haven't even got outside yet. Come through. I think at a home of this calibre you've got to have a second sitting room or living area and this is it. At the back here, it's got two sets of stackers that open up to a very big veranda. Um, it was only commenting a moment ago with that probably how many people you can comfortably seat out here or entertain. We've got spotted gum, timber decking. Once again, only the highest quality materials used. You could probably see in that um, light there that the, the paintwork is A1. It's only not long painted the ex exterior of the property. So, make sure you have lighting this place through nicely to the garage. We missed on the way. So, you need to look up when you first walk in. That's obviously a drop down ladder because um, there's plenty of storage up in the, the roof void. It's quite a high pitch. Uh, and yeah, you've got flooring up there for extra storage, so multitude of storage options. But this garage is 10 metres in length and close to 6 metres wide, I think it's 5.9 exactly. Um, there is internal access, it's an automatic opener, and pretty sure you can still see me, but yeah, this is um, where you can set up a home gymnasium or you can have a, a self contained office set up, which a lot of people are there working from home. So just to have that extra space, still be able to put a couple of cars away, you can park a couple of outside. Um, it's a really good option for those looking for the future to basically be future proof. We've got to think about these things now, haven't we? And that'll lead into a, a really valid one in the backyard there, the aqua gym. So this is um, all fixtures. Nice big workbench, once again, great storage. Nice and easy to uh, maintain. You can see everything you have, obviously, tell out in the corner there. Got a couple of double power points. Don't need that all over. And this is where you could sit for 12 months of the year out the back here. You get the morning sun in the back here. Um, we're facing east when we look out that way. You might be able to see some district lighting on the horizon. Generally, I can see more than most. But, um, Pop that, yeah, that up there, you can kind of see it. And I'd have to say this is one of the, the best things about this property is the aspect of this outdoor area. Um, not only have you got plenty of undercover space, you've got an alfresco space out the back there with the um, artificial turf. And you can maybe able to see there's a bit of greenery there which is all established. Virtually no maintenance in the backyard here, so there's a few few stones in the pathways and where it's green is all artificial turf so no mowing required. Just get that leaf blower in reverse and suck up a few leaves from time to time. There's a very comfortable walkway over to the other access into the back of the house. This just opens up to a big double door built-in laundry. LED lighting in there as well. All nicely appointed, nicely tiled. And we look down here and there's a gentleman actually operating the wood fired pizza oven down there at the moment. He looks like he knows what he's doing actually. So um, that's fantastic. You shouldn't smell it. It's um, coming along nicely. 
a nice wide staircase, hardwood, hardwood treads. Walk down here, they'll have a spot of gum. And once again, only the highest quality inclusion is used. And I'll just point out a few of the features of this undercover outdoor entertaining area. So we have the deck upstairs, um, which you can comfortably keep 30 or 40 people undercover. And then you've got an equivalent space down here. It's quite a bit larger. You've got four metal ceilings at this end, and it slopes down. There's the opportunity there for a um, home theatre to be set up with a projection on the wall over there. Um, they've just got seating, it's quite casual, and you've got a water feature on the wall here which does a great job with that effect. Um, this is the, probably the hero of the moment. What's going on behind me over here? Probably a bench stop. I think there's enough wood supply there for a few years to come yet as well. Well, if you're anything like me, you um, probably fire this up, thing up more often than not. This is all hard stand where I'm walking here. It's very low maintenance, just a bit of a blower, blow the leaves. I'm going to get, get a couple from the citrus trees behind me. We've got lemon and lime, a couple of different types of lime. And out the back behind you, you can see there is an aqua spa. And it has four jets at one end, four up this end, you've got different settings. Um, Quite a valuable piece of uh, equipment. Perfect for those who um, well, set it, it's currently set at 22 degrees, but you could quite comfortably ramp that up or cool it down if you need. It's got a range of therapy options to go with it. Um, it's quite simple to operate in terms of the strength of the jets up in the airplane. to know where it is. Well I'll tell you it's uh, 22 Hill Street Walls End and it runs off Nelson Street and obviously with the name being Hill it's quite elevated and it's just to the west of the, the main township so around a couple of minutes away but that's, if you didn't hear that it's 22 Hill Street Walls End. Um, we very much look forward to showing it again this weekend. As I said it has had high demand um, but we are open uh, for viewings by appointment only obviously and private inspections this coming weekend again um, or if there's an alternate day or time actually met some people here tonight at five and yeah it's not a hassle feel free to contact myself or the team and our landline is 49 double five six nine hundred um, really look forward to uh, meeting you here and like i said by appointment we're available to show it um, between nine and three this coming weekend on saturday or alternatively, just give us a call.
I'm Paul from Crowley Property and um, thank you very much for watching. Proudly bring this property to you.